this is something that's been a little more than two years in the making down here in the Queen City of the Carolinas. A league record, close to 75,000 fans are here to watch Charlotte FC's inaugural home game as this MLS expansion team has really become a part of the sports fabric here in Charlotte, North Carolina. Yeah, I'm, just, I'm actually so you know proud of this you know city. It's, there's 75,000 know, or 74,000 tonight, um, and that's just when you know that this city has just been growing, growing each year. And now I feel like this is kind of like you know the climax of it, and you know hopefully we can kind of just keep building. I cannot, I, I cannot describe with words the energy. It really was a party. City wide today. Everywhere you went, you saw people it wearing Charlotte gear. It's a to a party. They came to party tonight. Find a strong group, all right? Come on, let's get together. Well, listen, we know this is a battle for hearts and minds. We know you only get one chance to make a first impression. At the end of the night, for these 75,000 people here, win or lose, they have to leave saying, you know what? I saw something special. I saw something that was incredible. I saw something that is worth my time and is worth my money and is worthy of being called sharp. It's been a wild scene the last couple hours. Now it's time to play a game, and this is more fans than most of these players will have ever played in front of. Really use that, harness that energy to your advantage. These players deserve by the, the, the job that they do every day, these people supporting and this energy. It was amazing, but this support from, from our fans is like unbelievable, unbelievable. And in front of an MLS record crowd, near 75,000 fans, here comes Charlotte FC and the LA Galaxy. <laughs> it was unbelievable, I'll tell you what. What I knew the most was the national anthem and everybody was singing. Um, that's just when it kind of really hit me that like, you know, this is it. This is what I've been working for, like for something my whole life. A wonderful scene has been set and this really is one of the most fun things we get to do. To welcome Charlotte FC to the league. What sort of a welcome are they going to get from the Galaxy tonight? And can we see some more history made in front of 75,000 fans, the biggest crowd in MLS history, we're underway. You know, we want that first 10, 15 minutes, especially at home, we want to kind of be direct and kind of, you know, have our good pressure that we usually have and, you know, with our structure a little bit, our defensively. And, you know, we want to kind of pin them into their end a little bit and you know for the first 10 15 minutes and then at some point they're going to back off and then we're going to you know hopefully you know start to play out like we usually do well, the cross hooked in towards jordy right on cleared off the line in the first half in some moments that they were better than us because they have very good players you know and technically they are top we were able to suffer and we kept fighting. Chicharito making the run. Chicharito saved by Christian Kalina. Now that we're kind of, you know, getting our groove on, kind of getting that daily routine of, you know, his kind of structure and play style, uh, I feel very, very comfortable now. And I'm sure all the rest of the guys feel the same way. Brings it down. Lindsey, now Reyna. Reyna right across the face of goal. I'm so proud of how we played defensively. Like we, we had a bunch of blocks. Like you said, Clean had a great couple of saves. A chip up for Julian Araujo. Early cross, Chicharito! What a save by Kalina! I think everyone is kind of like defensively was on the same page today, which is really good. Working on Lindsay, Douglas Costa to the byline and closed down there by Lindsay out for a corner. I mean, Chicharito, for example, he didn't score, but. He push our center backs until you know the, the their limits. I mean, but very proud of, of especially Fuchs, Macron, uh, Jalen, and and, and Corujo, uh, that they did amazing. 
for defense you can uh, make in two three weeks really good defense about moving shifting and uh, our rules how we must to be in possession but the the main things in football is to, to score the goals and this is the most difficult we'll need a little bit more time for this but uh, uh, how we play i think it's uh, it was really really good Fuchs, right, ball. back into Swiderski on the turn. Carol Swiderski cuts it around Delgado. Swiderski saved by Bond. In front of the biggest crowd in MLS history, just shy of 75,000 fans, all to play for in the second half. I mean, the second half, we were much, much better. We still had offensive chances too that were really good. Um, obviously, do we want to, you know, score those kind of chances? Of course. And I think once we get, you know, through halfway through the season, I mean, look, I think we're being a really, really good team. Lindsay down the line, Gaines. Can he get inside Edwards? Yes, he can. Early cross. The, the Argentinian say hierarchia, uh, quality of the players. I mean. In one moment, they can unbalance like that. They can, they can create something. But then they give the ball away in their own half. Alvarez trying his luck at the goal! Efrain Alvarez with an absolute stutter! We were able to finish the game pushing and uh, going forward and trying to score. So for me, this is a big, big step. If we are focusing the game, nothing else. The people will help you to, you know, to go, to go, to go, to go forward. A 20-year-old from Baltimore, number one pick of the draft, swings this in. Kleshin back in the middle of the field. Douglas Costa had to react first. And now Kula Ball. He couldn't get it clear. It's Christian Fuchs. Saved by Bond. Bender resets, oh. and it's off the outside of the post. Charlotte are arguing for a penalty there as Fuchs was trying to wriggle his way in. If we are able to compete until the end uh, with these big clubs that we are facing now at the beginning of the, of the season, um, we have the most important. I mean, we have the base to build from now. And in one moment, I believe the, the, the scores uh, will, will arrive for us. Jair Marufo ends the game. The Galaxy spoil the party. And the biggest crowd in MLS history showing their appreciation, even in disappointment, for their brand new team who battled the whole way. Thank you, North Carolina, South Carolina, Charlotte, uh, everyone that came today. And one request, I would like to see them back in the next game. These fans, as you said, applauding. They came here for a party. They didn't get the result that they wanted, but I think soccer's in the South. It's here to stay. What an incredible event. That was probably the, you know, the kind of best game to be a part of. I've been, I've been part of like my entire life. And, you know, like you know, before walking off the pitch, you know, I kind of sat right in the middle, midfield, and I was just trying to soak it all in. Like, you know, I was picturing myself, like, you know, seven, eight years ago, um, kind of in the nose, please, watching Panthers games and, you know, countless uh, ICC games in the summer, the European teams, and, you know, now that I'm that person on the field, uh, it was just unbelievable. And, you know, that's just why I'm just so proud of, you know, of myself, um, you know, to be here, and I'm so proud of the team, how we played, and uh, it was just, it was just a great night, and, you know, like one of the best nights of my life, to be honest with you.